What's going on guys? I hope everyone's well. Now I think everyone can see that this whole court case has been nothing but a waste of time and just Amber Heard's constant lies upon lies and it was actually Johnny who was a victim of abuse. He was punched in the face, he had his face scratched, he had his fingers severed and just constant abuse thrown at him and manipulation. Not to say that Johnny is a complete angel because no one's perfect in this unperfect world as it is. But to say he was violent and abusive towards Amber Heard is, is just ridiculous at this point. Not just from an observer point of view but as an insider point of view. Many people from the industry have always said how kind and how loved Johnny is within the community. But it's not all doom and gloom. We've had some hilarious fails from Amber Heard's team. From objecting your own question. You didn't know what could cause damage to Mr. Depp's hand while you were there on March 8th, correct? Dr. Kipper had told me he'd sustained an injury on uh, one of his well, fingers. Uh, objection, here's, hearsay. Wait, you, you asked the question. Okay. Oh. Next question. Okay, you said he sustained a, an injury to... And then take a massive dump on the f*** and bed. What was the photograph of Mr. Depp? It was a, it was a, it was a photograph of the bed, our bed, um, and on my side of the bed, um, was human fecal matter. Call me crazy, but I don't think dumping on someone's side of the bed is considered normal in any situation or relationship. My initial response to that was... I mean, I laughed. I, I, the, it was so outside. It was so bizarre and so grotesque that I could only laugh. Let's also not forget when she had the makeup to cover up the different bruises of different days of each week and then the actual makeup company comes out makes a tech tick 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 <laughs> They made a TikTok clarifying that she was lying by showing a catalogue proving that that makeup product at that time was not released and was released in 2017. This was what she used. She became very adept at it. And you're gonna hear the testimony from Amber about how she had to mix the different colors for the different days of the- Thing you can expect from me and that's the unexpected. Cause I'm an international super spy. Super spy! Uh, boom. Even when Dakota Johnson was working with Johnny Depp at a panel, she noticed his hand and even she could see something was not right. If you watch her reaction, she sees his hand when they're talking and he has a little joke about it. And as he looks away, she keeps looking at his hand and as she looks up, she has a big gulp. So Dakota can notice there's something definitely gone wrong and something's definitely not right here. Over the years, uh, socially and, and, and personally, um, Johnny is one of the most uh, soulful and kind-hearted and, and, and gentle uh, humans that I know. So to see him then transform into a man who was uh, at times diabolical and, and ultimately sociopathic was uh, a transformation that I had... Uh, uh, from what many people have seen from the court's perspective is that Johnny has got a lot of backing over this and it is clearly, well what I can see, he's clearly going to win this case. And being only day 12, we have so much more yet to come out. So what team are you guys on? Team Johnny? Team Amber? Let me know in the comments. Give the video a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more content. I'll catch you all later. Peace.